Hi everyone, happy Monday morning. Okay, so um, I have been like driving the struggle bus the last few weeks. I have fallen off the wagon hard with my nutrition. I crave brownies all the time. If you don't know me, my name is Jack Callagher. I am 26 weeks pregnant with my fourth boy and um, it's busy, like life is crazy busy. And so I've been making a thousand and one excuses of why my nutrition needs to lack or why I'm on the go or like guys seriously like I have just been not rocking it good morning Maggie good morning Tracy if you're on let me know you're on so this morning I am gonna go through really quick the easiest meal plan ever I hate meal planning I hate it I am a health and fitness coach but I hate it hi Jessica um so I was like what am I gonna do to start over um so that I can get through the rest of this pregnancy without gaining, I'll probably gain 40 pounds anyways, it's just what I do. I just don't wanna be so dang tired, okay? So, with weight gain and pregnancy, everybody is different. They say 15 to 25 pounds, but I gotta be real, y'all. It's my fourth pregnancy. I gain 40 pounds whether I'm healthy or not, and it's really hard <laughs> um, when you're comparing yourself to others. Good morning, Catherine. So, here we go. Last night I sat down, I recreated my workout plan. I picked out of my on-demand, which I have access, it's like Netflix, if you guys don't haven't heard me talk about it. Guys, it's awesome. It's like Netflix for workout programs, and there's so many different things. So what I did was I went over my, I think it was five of my favorite programs, which included um, Core to Force, of course, like my MMA style program, yoga, um, what else, what else, what else? some weightlifting and some cardio. So I created my own, good morning, Brittany. I created my own workout schedule for the next five weeks to bring me out to 31 weeks pregnant. And in addition, I am following this super, super, super easy meal plan. So I'm gonna tell you right now, all right, if you don't have a pen and paper, you can grab it or you can come back and watch this. But what I did was I did this formula to find out how many calories I would need for pregnancy to maintain a healthy pregnancy, right? Because I'm not trying to lose weight. Hi, Brock, how the heck are you, man? Um, I'm not trying to lose weight. I'm just not trying to take like seven naps a day because that's where I am right now, taking lots of naps, feeling tired as F, and I don't wanna do that anymore. So my caloric intake, I am on what's called Plan C, and I eat, get this, this is how much I eat a day. Whew, week one, six containers of veggies, four containers of fruits, five containers of proteins, four containers of carbs, one of healthy fats, one of dressings, five teaspoons of healthy fats, and then I get my Energize, I get my Recover, I get my Shakeology, I get all my good stuff that I couldn't live without. So, I went over, I did this meal plan, my caloric intake is anywhere from 1,800 to 2,100 calories, and I'm good with that, because I need a lot of food, okay? Raise your hand, drop an emoji if you love food. Drop an emoji if you struggle with eating. Anything like that, guys, this plan is for you. It does not take, I mean, I sat down, I figured out my my caloric intake in like seconds, because um, there's a formula with like weight and you add 500 calories for pregnancy or breastfeeding. And if you're not and you wanna lose weight, you just drop it, like that's a super easy formula. Yes, thank you, Tracy. Hi, Emily. Um, so. I went over and I was like, oh, okay, now I'm looking at, and I'm, I'm looking at my computer right now, I'm not like looking into space, you guys. So I was looking at it and I'm like, okay, I have my five weeks of workouts planned out. It's a great balance of yoga and a rest day. Hey, Mo. <laughs> um, and so I have that planned out. Gotta do the meal plan, gotta do the meal plan. Guys, literally, this is so easy. Yes, Brock struggles, Maggie struggles, Catherine struggles, and I hate that you guys struggle, but at least we're not struggling by ourselves. So my meal plan, looks like this, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, I eat the same thing. I'm fine with that. I'm so fine with that because I don't wanna do all the things. I don't wanna do all the cooking. I don't want to. So I'll give you example for today. So I had my shake first thing in the morning because I had no ingredients for anything. I j literally just grocery shopped. And then I just had two eggs, a cup of chopped spinach, two tablespoons of cheese. I love cheese. Oh, I forgot to have a fruit. And I get a fruit. So after I'm done with this, I'll eat an apple. Snack, I get my shako, half a banana. Um, lunch, I get a chicken salad, carrots, tomatoes, black beans, um, an oil-based dressing, half an eighth of an avocado. And then I have another snack. I eat a small apple, three te teaspoons of nut butter, and a cup of a vegetable. And then for dinner, dude, this is a lot of food. I get salmon, mashed sweet potatoes, coconut oil, broccoli, and another fruit. 
Like, hello, that's one day. That's what I will be eating today. So I went grocery shopping. I'm gonna turn y'all around and show you. This is not just for me. I had a couple of meals I doubled up for my husband. He doesn't know that he's just starting this today, <laughs> but he totally is. Let me turn you around and show you. Guys, this is, this is legit. Look at all this food. I'm not kidding. It is a ton of food. And a lot of this is just for me. So I get seven apples. I get, there's mandarins for me. I'll share them with my kids. Cashews, some meals. I get raw almonds, raw cashews. I get cauliflower, broccoli, my black beans. I'm using this for my creamer because um, I started drinking black coffee, but I don't like it while I'm pregnant. So I'm using this dairy-free almond milk creamer, 10 calories, real almond and coconut cream. I'm cool with that. That's not on my meal plan. I'm cool with adding it. I use my almond milk for my shakes along with water and some spinach. Obviously my bananas. I have our salmon that we have for dinner. This is for my husband. This is not for me, um, but he loves tuna. So I'm that person. I can't buy tuna unless it's like properly fished because I'm an ocean addict. So I bought the tuna, a little bit expensive on the canned tuna, $3.69. My sister's like, why don't you buy the cheap kind? I'm like, cause I can't, I can't do that. Um, I got eight sweet potatoes. <laughs> Look at all this celery. This is for Brian and I, so that's for two people. Um, this is for the family. This is for the family. This is for the family. So I have ground turkey. I have no nitrate ham. I have flank steak. I have tomatoes, strawberries, blueberries, grapes. Look at all these greens, y'all. That is a ton of food. I have cabbage and I have carrots. Now, when you're looking at this, like, I'm not kidding. I was really, I'm like craving all of this. But when I was going grocery shopping before, I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't go with a plan and I was stressing out hardcore. Now, let me turn. Okay, so that's a lot of food, right? And I would sit here and before I would be like, yeah, ooh. Sorry, my jams popped on. Ready? Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm addicted to The Greatest Showman. So, um, let me try to put you over here. It's going to it's gonna turn, keep turning on. There we go. So, I don't know about you guys, but I would often go to the store with a grocery list, and then I wouldn't use any of the food, and I would just mix it all together, and I would freak out. So, I already told you. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, all the same. And then I have Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday, all the same. And I'm going to turn around so you can see too this is what it looks like guys all I have to do is print off one sheet it tells me my meals every day and your caloric intake might be different than mine so let me show you this is plan C and D this is all stuff that you get with your program legit it comes with every program I love this meal plan the most because it is the easiest then each week this is week three so this is the one I just showed you but week three, this is your shopping list, guys. It tells you how many of each. Like, for real? Can it get any easier? If you are a busy mom, if you are a busy dad, if you are just a busy person, because life is busy, guys, this is the way to do it. Don't sit there and say, like I did, I can't do it. It's going to be so crazy. Like, oh, Jennifer, do you have... Okay, so... All the meal plans that I follow, because they're balanced, because they are not diets, I don't do diets. I freak out on diets. And even on Sunday, you guys, I already said to my sister, I'm like, Sunday's kind of my free day because we always go to brunch after church. I love pancakes. I'm not giving up pancakes. Baby number four loves them as well. <laughs> and even still, it's about a balance. It's not about cutting out this stuff so you can lose weight faster. It's about creating a lifestyle that you can live forever. So when I go over these things and we, I recommend based on, so this is what my clients do. My clients, my coaches, every time we're rewriting the plan, every time we're coming up with something else, I have them, hey, answer a couple questions. Let's go in, let's figure out your caloric intake. Let's figure out which work, workout program will be best for you based off of what the heck you like. Not off what's gonna help you lose the weight the fastest or what, you know, Tom, Dick, or Harry's doing down the road is what's going to work for you. Because guess what? If you start doing yoga, but you don't like yoga, are you going to like still do it? Probably not. Yes, Jennifer, I can't do diets. <laughs> like I freak out. I freak out. So last night when I was sitting there, I'm like, okay, what's the easiest meal plan? What is, when I've looked at meal plans, which one did I not struggle on the most? Okay. That's like, I told you, I drive the struggle bus. Um, and so this one, Plan C Shift Shop is the one I love. 
if you guys don't have access to what we call BOD, you guys need to message me. Okay, our new group started today. You could literally sign up and get access today to all the meal plans, all the nutrition, your meal plan that matches you, not me and my pregnancy, your meal plan that matches you, but you see this. It's real food, it's balanced food, it's balanced nutrition, you're not dieting, because dieting doesn't work, and you're not gonna be stuck or trapped doing a program that sucks. You only have 10 minutes a day. Dude, there are program, programs that are 10 minutes a day. I went in and for, I'll even show you my workouts. Let me see, look at this. So this is the one I created for the next five weeks. These are my workouts. So these, these are the timelines because I need to know these are the actual workouts, this is the program, these are the weeks. Guys, I know Mondays are crazy busy. I only wanna do 22 minutes. So I'm gonna start out with cardio today. And then I only have like one workout here or there that's that long. This is what I have. This is my level of focus right now at this time in my life. And this is gonna take me straight to 31 weeks of pregnancy. If I find it's too much and one rest day isn't enough, I will implement another rest day on one of my really busy days during the week. But I have control over it. you guys. That's what I love. I mean, the programs are designed to get you the best results when you follow them start to finish. But the, the programs are also designed to fit with whatever lifestyle you have, whatever's going on in your life. I can't follow this program, so I have to quit, and now I can't do anything. Nope. <laughs> Replan the plan, my friend. So if you need help, we are starting today. I haven't even done my workout. You're not far behind. You can sign up, get access to the workouts, to the meal plan. I grocery shop this morning. Like, you're not behind. But message me. Let's do this. I have a couple hours before I go pick up my littles, and I want to help you guys get started. This, guys, it's April. It's April 16th. I don't know how, how the heck we got to where we are, but we're here. April 16th. I know for me, I'm going to try and rock a two-piece with my big old belly, but I want to feel good about myself in the summer. I don't need to be at my best chiseled body. I just want to have more energy to play with my kids. I want to have energy to just enjoy my life. And if I want to rock a two-piece, I want to rock it and feel good about myself because I've put in the work, not because I'm at my chiseled, I, I'm ripped. Because let's be honest, when I'm wearing a two-piece in a couple months, I'm going to be like nine months pregnant. I'm not going to be ripped. So you need help, reach out. We have a few more spots. Again, we start today, okay? But meal plans, workouts, support, like you can't beat that. But I love you guys. Have a, have a happy Monday. I got to put my groceries away and then I have to do my 22 minute workout. So I love you. If this video helped you at all, just go ahead, share some love on it. Go ahead, like it, love it. Share it with your friends. Invite people to watch it because they need to see that this option is available for them. They don't have to do the all or nothing option because that sucks and doesn't work. And we don't do diets, okay? So love you guys. Have a great Monday. Bye.